I'm Madison Myers, your neighborhood reporter in Rosebud. I'm here outside of City Hall where a group of people are gathering in a fight for justice for local families. Some of our neighbors in Rosebud spent Thursday morning protesting outside of City Hall. They were there to show their support for Adelia Martinez, a disabled resident of the Lot Housing Authority. Adelia was there to attend her eviction hearing with Judge J.P. Polk. The Housing Authority's reasoning for her eviction, a failure to complete annual recertification. But Adelia claimed she was discriminated against for being disabled. I tried everything, everything I can think of just to need help because she discriminated me. Adelia says she failed to complete her recertification because her father and overseer is not allowed on the property due to previous charges of criminal trespassing. As a result, she was unable to complete the process on her own. But Deborah Goffney and the Lot Housing Authority says Martinez had nearly a year to get the certification done. Judge J.P. Polk ruled in favor of the Lot Housing Authority, giving Martinez five days to appeal. Anyway, too good because my lawyer, our lawyer didn't show up today. That's the first thing. Uh, she had to handle it by herself. I'll give her credit. Adelia's dad telling me this isn't the end in their fight for justice. We're going to appeal this case. It's not over. It's this, they're lying. You know, we got the fact. We got uh, evidence. We got video. I attempted to speak with Mrs. Goffney about the allegations against her and the housing authority. Would you like to say anything to the families here that feel that you've discriminated against them? Although she refused to comment at the time, I later received a written statement from the Lot Housing Authority saying, quote, Mrs. Martinez's actions could have resulted in the Lot Housing Authority losing federal status, causing residents to lose their homes. The Lot Housing Authority took the necessary steps to file an eviction, including terminating her lease. We applaud Justice Polk and LHA for taking the proper steps to ensure that citizens of Lot can continue to have a housing authority in the community. For a full copy of this statement, you can visit our website. Adelia's lawsuit trial against the Lot Housing Authority is set for September 25th in Marlin. We'll continue to follow this story as it unfolds. Your Lot Neighborhood Reporter, Madison Myers.